In this video we're going to look at all the gear that I use for all the different types of photography that I do from weddings to sports to events. The first thing I've got is my full frame Nikon D700 here uh, with the optional bot uh, battery pack and I usually fill that up with 8 AA batteries so I can get the 7 frames a second. Beside that one of the best cameras uh, ever, Fuji S5 Pro which is really the most awesome camera for weddings. Not great for fast frames a second or anything, but its dynamic range is unsurpassable. And on the Fuji I've also got my Nikon 20mm f2.8 AIS lens, which is quite an unusual old-fashioned manual focus lens. Beside that, I've got my Nikon 50mm f1.4, which I got before the prices went up for about it was just under £200 at that time. Then beside that I've got an old Nikon 105mm f2.8 macro lens, or micro lens. Uh, again that was second hand, got that for around about £200. Then one of my smallest lenses, the Nikon Fisheye 10.5mm f2.8. This was actually one of the few lenses which I've bought brand new and that one was quite an expensive one, around about £399 at the time when I bought it. Then the beast in the background, that again was a second hand lens, uh, it's a Nikon 70 to 200mm f2.8 and that one was around about £1000 as well. And also to get a filter on there that's about an extra 50 quid because it's such a huge lens. In the background you notice I've got four flashes, I always think you can never have too many flashes. Uh, three of them are SB900s and one is an SB800. Next along the line we have the Tamron 28-75mm to 75 millimeter lens. Now this is my one of my cheapest, it was about £250, I got it for second hand, but it's one of the best and it's one of my most used lenses as well. Uh, I use it in pretty much every situation and it works on both my full frame and my cropped sensor cameras, great for film. The zooming is very jittery if you're doing that in video but you should never do that and uh, and because it, it's so cheap and so light and so small I've been able to take it pretty much everywhere I go. Then one of my latest lenses is the Samyang 85mm again, a second hand lens got for around about £200 again or I think about £190 I got it for um, and that's an f1.4, an 85 f1.4 lens. Um, quite amazing but manual focus only. Then lastly, uh, the things that I use are my two tripods, uh, one's a metal photo pro and the other one is a carbon fibre, both very nice and light tripods. So that is the camera gear.